God damn it. You got school tomorrow, and I want you home. All right, Pop, okay, all right. Oh, 
this red. Wow. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. That is, nice. That is sweet, man. I would marry that. <laughs> Ain't no some of Vinny's high school sweeties, huh? Vinny, hey, you ever get any of that stuff? Yeah. Hey, hey, come on. Hey, come on. Wait a minute. Hey, you got the ship, man. We got business to take care of. Go ahead. Sorry, all right? Apologize, asshole. I said apologize. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, look, Brenda. We say, we say me and you, we get together. We have a little party, huh? I get some good shit. We get high. I mean, the possibilities are endless. Oh. How does that sound to you? How does that sound? Let's see. Almost <laughs> as good as drowning in a pool of vomit. Hey, it's your loss, Brenda. Maybe some other time if you're lucky, huh? <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Hey, fat. Hey, hey. hey, I tried to get a hold of you. Stick around, sweetie. The party's just start. <laughs> Jake, we don't want no trouble. Neither do we, fat, and we just want our money. You know, I, I like this guy. There's something about him. Yeah, Romeo. me too. <laughs> but he's always two days late. I tried to collect. I think he's trying to sell our blow on credits. And he don't have our money. Yeah, that ain't true, huh? You tell him. You got our money, right? Maybe tomorrow, Jake. I think he's holding out on us, Jake. Now, you wouldn't do that now, would you? Huh? Huh? Just there, huh? Hey, Jake. Maybe he hit it. <laughs> hey, Red. Check out his girl. I'm bringing the money, Jake. You know, I really like this guy. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys! Whoa, whoa, whoa. <gasps> Would you check yes, out me. the schlong on him? Uh, you know, I'll bet he has to put it on the nightstand when he goes to bed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, anything over <gasps> ten inches is a waste. I always say. Uh, <laughs> Keeps her mind off of working two shifts to pay for our old man's funeral. Hey, Brent. Check it out. What do you think's going on over there? No, oh, it's your typical all-American dope dealers at work. I'd love to teach those bastards a lesson. Hey, somebody should. Hey, Heather. Would you like to go for a nice ride in a convertible? Uh, good, Brenda. It's <laughs> good. good. Yeah, I like that.
sex. Mm. I know. <laughs> I'd give it up for good. Except it's got too many calories. Oh. Thank God. <laughs> I think I came twice already. Oh. Nice talk. <laughs> I got your money, Jake. I'll have it here tomorrow. It ain't good enough. I want the blow and the money here in one hour. That's 60 minutes. You got that? I got it, Jake. Douchebag. <laughs> get the hell back to class. Who the fuck is this asshole? <laughs> Vince! <laughs> what are you doing with these guys? He's sick, man. We're bringing them home. You sick, Vince? Yeah, man, he's got the clap. <laughs> <laughs> Go fuck an iceberg. <laughs> no, I don't want to see any of you guys around my schoolyard. You or any of your scum. Oh, man, who the fuck are you? The principal? That's right! And as for you, Vince, you want to trash your life, go ahead. But do it on your own time, not mine. You hear that? Yes, sir. Now, why don't you take your faggot asses out of here before I feed him to the cops? Too tight, our hips are shaking from left. 
to the right, to the left. Look at that, Jake. <laughs> Look at that. You know who that is, don't you, Jake, huh? <laughs> you think she had fun when she filled her car with garbage, huh? What do you say, Jake, huh? huh? <laughs> Shut up, Red. <laughs> day was fine. I'll tell you what, I'll go get changed and I'll walk you home, okay? Okay. What? What are you doing? For me? Heather, what did you do? Heather, it's beautiful. Oh, God, I love you so much. Hey, you listen to me? You move real nice, you know that? Say, you can't hear me, can you? I ain't never talked to no deaf chick before. You're real pretty, you know that? Do you think I'm doing the right thing, Brenda? Marrying Richie and everything? If I had a guy that wanted to marry me, you don't think I'd get out of this shithole? Richie didn't exactly want to marry me until I told him I was pregnant. I mean, I know he loves me. I mean, he would have married me sooner or later. I promise we won't tell anyone, okay? Honey, I love you like a sister. We're going to throw you a wedding you'll never <laughs> forget. All right, Heather's waiting for me. So I'm going to go, and I'll see you at the MX Club later, okay? Okay. Just remember, I'm the godmother. So if it's a girl, Brenda's the name. <laughs> <laughs> Now I got one to teach you. Do you know what uh, this means? Come on, try it. Go on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you got it. You got it. Yeah. <laughs> you and I have things to discuss. Cindy, Cindy, Cindy. God, this is your lucky day. And you want to know why? I'll tell you. See, I don't have time to kick your ass right now. So you best be moving out of my way, okay? I want you to stay away from my boyfriend. Oh, God, where's that faggot? Oh, come on, who the hell wants him? He's mine, understand? 
So keep your hands off. God, you stupid, stuck-up cunt. If you could make him stay away from me, I'd be eternally grateful to you. You're the one! You keep leading him on. Let me see if I can make this simpler so that even you can understand. I wouldn't fuck him if he had the last dick on earth. I bet you've never been kissed by a real man before. You yeah. have. Who kissed you, huh? Who? I don't know what you're talking about, babe. Oh, your father. Well, where's he now? Dead, huh? Well, that's too bad. <laughs> Shit, kissing your old man, that don't count. He's fucking dead. And I'm alive and twitching. So how about you and me have a crack at it, huh? What do you think? Sure. Please stop crying, Miss Clark. Would you please stop crying? Thank you. Now blow your nose and get the hell out of here. Brenda, you give me nothing but grief. I won't have it. God damn it, I simply will not have it. And I'm warning you for the last time. You know, I don't understand it. You're a bright girl. You got a pretty face. A good figure. Fabulous, <laughs> turn. It's Red's turn.
salt. Ryan? I know, Mom. I got open up early today. Jake and the scars left school an hour before it happened. Oh, yes, well, would you bring us another round, Susie? And uh, tell Jack they're on the house. Do you have any idea who did it? No. But you can sure bet I'm gonna find out who did it. She couldn't even scream for help. All I keep seeing is this little girl trying to open her mouth and nothing comes out. So what's your school going to do about it? They'll put us in the gym and make some speech. Even the cops are a bunch of pussy. It's up to us to make things right. Right. I'm going to get up. Damn right. Now, look, you better be careful, baby. Whoever these dudes are, they don't just play games. Charlene, I lose her. She's gonna make it, honey. You just gotta believe. And what, God? I gave up when my father died. Charlene, I love her so much. What am I gonna do if Heather dies? So worried about Vincy, boy. I bet you she enjoyed it. I didn't go to school today. I didn't hear nothing. You didn't go to school today? Oh, sick. Oh, sick. <laughs> boy, you feel sick? Yeah. 
I was sick. I felt sick, Jake. <laughs> come on, come with us. Yeah, where are we going? We're gonna go have a good time. Maybe we're gonna get laid. No, 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 I don't think so. It wouldn't be a good idea. I'm gonna go home. <laughs> go get your jacket. <laughs> Me and Richie are thinking about moving away. What? When the time's right? Yeah. I want to have kids soon, you know? Yeah. I don't want my kid growing up in this shit. Me and Richie are thinking about getting a farm. Right. Yeah, you know, with dogs and horses and that kind of stuff. Don't forget the pigs. Baby pigs. No, it sounds dumb. I don't know shit about fun. The way I figure it, if I can survive all the crap on this street, I can sure as hell raise a chicken or two. I've got to go to the bathroom so bad, I'm going to have to wring out my socks. I'll be right back. Okay. Keep all the girls away from the chain. I'll be right back. Can I go now, Jay? You still here? <laughs> hey, Vinny, ain't this great? We get to stay up late tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Vinci's having a good time. <laughs> we get you late again, Vinci. <laughs> Come on, Jake. Oh, that little peepee -pee gonna be working overtime tonight, David. Oh. <laughs> it's hot already. <laughs> Come on, don't. What do you think, Vinci? Huh? <laughs> Every 
just here to have a good time. Don't be looking for trouble. What's the problem? There's no problem. Just leave the girl alone. Yeah, you're right, man. I'm sorry, all right? Hey, let her go. What's the matter with you? Get up there and tell this guy you're sorry. <laughs> You want me to tell this guy I'm sorry? He always fucking embarrassing me. Okay, Jake. If you want me to tell him I'm sorry, I'll tell him. Hey, man. I'm sorry! <laughs> one another for the world which seems to lie before us like a land of dreams so various so beautiful so new so boring <laughs> <laughs> what do you think the poet is talking about here yes Cindy a day at the beach oh, oh, all right. Right. I think he had a little more on his mind than that how come this book ain't got no real poetry? And what's real poetry, Richie? How you know. Stuff that makes sense. Give us an example. Come on, Richie. Put up or shut up. You want a real poem? A real poem? OK. Yeah, come on. Here it goes, an original. Oh, right. Right, right, yeah. Disco sucks. Punk is dead. Give me rock. Give me head. Oh, no <laughs> now, wait a minute. Richie's right in his own way. What he's just recited is real poetry. It has a rhythm, it rhymes, and it has meaning. Now, according to this poem, what place does rock and roll have in this poet's life? Richie? I don't know. I guess it's real important. As important as what? As important as getting head. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down, Richie. Yeah. <laughs> Maria, what does getting head mean? Oh, he's <laughs> young. I don't think I should be talking about that stuff in school. It's like doing it, right? <laughs> Go ahead, Maria, talk about it. I give you permission. Well, I think it has something to do with sex. <laughs> <laughs> and what word rhymes with head? Bobby. Dead. Now. How do sex and death connect? Francine? Sort of like, till death do his part. Like, sex and death last forever. Like love. OK, now we're talking about romance. I like that one. Okay, for tomorrow, I want you to look through chapter five and come up with other references to love and death. Brenda, can I see you for a couple of minutes after class? What? 
I just wanted to tell you how sorry I am about your sister. How is she? The doctors don't know anything. Brenda, I want you to know if you need someone to talk to, I'm here. Look, Miss Young, I know you mean well. You're a good teacher. But this has nothing to do with you. Stay out of it. Brenda, you can't take the whole world on by yourself. You see us maybe one or two hours a day. You don't know anything. I don't know, Brenda. I don't know. Don't you worry about Jake. He ain't gonna do shit. I did good, didn't I? Real good? You did great. Hi, Brenda. Uh, would you mind, uh, is it okay if I talk to you alone? What is it? I, I just wanted to tell you I really like you. <laughs> I don't know, I guess it's because you're, you're exciting. Like, it always seems like you're going to blow up or something. I don't know what you're going to do, and I like that. You are unbelievable. What? Well, well. It looks like the little sluts at it again. Put it out, Cindy. We're only talking. I know it's not your fault, Wes. Fuck off, bitch. All right, let's settle down. Let's settle down, everybody. Turn the radio off. Turn it off. Put that goddamn skeleton back where it belongs. Let's just settle down. Put her back in her seat, will you? And just sit down. Let's settle down. The bell is rung. Thank you. Now, if I could just hold your attention for a minute, I'd like to take you over to the chart. As you know, the reproductive system involves... <laughs> going on, Vincy? It's all off of school, Jake. The girl we raped. You think she's gonna die? Everybody dies. What are we gonna do, Jake? We've been all through this. So just calm the fuck down. I mean, she's a fucking retard, man. She can't even talk. <laughs> yeah. And the only way anybody's ever gonna find out if Vincy boy opens up his big fat mouth <laughs> Vince, you wouldn't do that, would you? Hey, Jake. You know I never do nothing to hurt the scars. Just forget about it. Now tell me where I can find that bitch that cut me. Well, since it's obvious that no one is prepared, I will simply have to go back and repeat yesterday's section on the ovaries. Miss Clark, you'll begin. I can't. You can't. Why can't you? My parents don't think we should be discussing this kind of stuff in school. And what do they think we should be discussing in this school? That people should be taught to stay in their own place and not try to pretend to be what they're not. <laughs> Don't push it, Cindy. Especially when they have retards in their family. That does it! No, Brenda. What are you gonna do about it? Get it! All right, girls. <laughs> I'm sorry, stop that, girls. Sorry about your sister, Brenda. The police are doing everything they can. But she shouldn't have been there in the first place. Fuck you. You're a tough little bitch, aren't you? I like that. 
but I don't give second warnings. So consider yourself suspended. I am never going to get out of this place. Yes, you will. Brenda, we're behind you 100%. We're here. Yeah. Yeah, we'll work it out. You. Come on. Yeah, all right, all right. Let's get organized. Francie, you and I are going to go pick up your dress. Shit, do I have to do it now? I can't handle it. We don't pick up your dress. You're going to be walking down the aisle bare ass. <clears throat> Brenda, we'll meet you guys at the MX Club at 4.30. Then we'll go see Heather. Everybody got that? Yes, got Mother. Okay. Come on. Okay, we're coming. Hey, kid. On, Nothing's going to ruin your big day. Okay? Francie, move your ass. I got to do some stuff for my mother. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Oh, God. Ta-da. Tráeme un poco de hilo blanco y un poco de listón. Mami, es que no tengo tiempo ahorita. Ay, niña, apúrate. Ay, ah, ya me voy. Ya me voy, ya me voy. Francine, remember, we're all meeting at the MX. Don't be late. OK, I'll be there, I'll be there. Ándale. Que ya voy, que siempre me están mandando como una niñita, ya. Oh, thank you. Jake, would I lie to you, Vincy? Huh? <laughs> 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 no, no! 
Oh, Jay! 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 God damn it, do it! No! Jay! Jay! No! No! Here comes the bride. She's all drenched in red. <laughs> come on, man, let's go. Come on, Fitzgerald. Come on! Come on! You sick motherfucker! I hate your guts! You hear me? I hate you! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! I hate you! I hate you! I hate you. you fuck! You're mine! You hear me? You're mine! She? I don't know, but visiting hours are almost over. Give the girl a break, will you? She's getting married in a couple of days. She's allowed to be a little spacey. Ah, uh, you should see her in this dress. Esta exquisita. Well, I'm getting a little pissed off. I don't like a woman to keep me waiting. Well, the way she cut up Jake last night, I wouldn't get her mad at me. Yeah, because she's just liable to cut you up three ways. Long, wide, and frequent. Woo! Uh, Get down, Stella. <laughs> Look, you guys stay here and wait for her. I, I gotta go to the hospital.
visitors during school nights. Oh, well, we were working on a school project, and it's due tomorrow. Maybe I could just see him for a minute. Please? For God's sake, it wasn't my fault. You're gonna die, Vince. Hey, why me? Huh? Yeah, it was Jake's idea, okay? So was Francine. What do you mean, so was Francine? He went crazy. I couldn't stop. What did he do, God damn it? What did he do? She's dead. He threw her off the bridge. I couldn't stop them! You bastards! <laughs> Bern, don't please! Please, my ass. I don't know if he looks at I can find him. He'd kill me if I told you. Yeah, the least you can do is let us watch. Just shut the fuck up and get out, will ya? I said get out! You're making a mistake, man. You know what? That son of a bitch is starting to piss me off. There ain't nothing wrong with us watching. Hey, you want to bitch about Jake, you bitch about Jake to Jake. Not to me. <laughs> Come on, let's go, man. I'm telling you, man, don't worry about Jake. He's okay. Didn't he give you sloppy seconds with the retard? <laughs> Didn't he let you watch that broad take flying lessons in a cement? <laughs> you know something, Reg? It was very, very neat the way she bounced when she hit that concrete. Bam! <laughs> What the fuck is that? Welcome home, assholes. You must be out of your mind coming here. Maybe she's looking for a little bit of what we gave her sister, huh? <laughs> Maybe she's looking for a whole lot more of what we gave her sister. How about it, Brenda? The both of us at once, baby. You're gonna love it. 
Hey. What is it? Wait a minute, man. I don't like it. Something's weird. What's the matter, boys? You get a little girl all hot and horny, then lose your nerve? What a shame. I'm gonna fuck that bitch. Yeah. Brenda! Brenda! <laughs> There's only one way in and one way out, baby. <laughs> You're laughing, huh, bitch? Okay, fuckface. You're not gonna be left when we get through with you. <laughs> You like Hide the Salami, don't you, Brenda? All you fucking cunts like Hide the Salami. Stop it out, the right asshole! Hide the Salami. I'm gonna hide that fucking salami so far up you. Goddamn Christopher Columbus couldn't find it. Came loaded for bear. You're gonna catch a bear. The biggest fucking bear you ever saw. Quit messing around, Fargo. Where are you? Well, well, well. Look who's here. The game's over, bitch. This time you're dead for sure. First, I'm gonna fuck you. And then, I'm gonna slice you into little pieces. Sounds nice and kinky to me. Too bad you're not double-jointed. Why? Because if you were, you'd be able to bend over and kiss your ass goodbye. You doing it, Fargo, huh? <laughs> you doing it? Yeah, oh. yeah, Fargo. Oh. We're both gonna do it. Oh, no. <laughs> Quit fucking around, Fargo. Where are you? Where's the pussy, huh? <laughs> hey, Fargo, what you doing, man? Where's the pussy, huh? Hey, man, quit fucking around, huh? What you doing? Ah! Now it's your turn with the pussy. No. No. Ah! Ah!
It's been long, Carol. I'll call you when I get back. Come on, you douchebags, open up! Come on, we're gonna celebrate! Come on, we're gonna party! Hey, come on! Come on, bitch, you want, you want a piece of me? Come on! No, Jake, you didn't get me, but I'm definitely gonna get you. No! Oh my, I missed, and I did so want to see you bleed to death. Oh well, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. Oh look. No more arrows. But I'll tell you what. I've got some more in the car. Now don't go away. Cut. Ah! 
I told you to stay where you were. Now look what you got yourself into. <laughs> you know what you look like? You look like a pig in a slaughterhouse, ready to butcher. You ever wonder what a pig must feel like before they slit his throat or cut his balls off? He couldn't have been any worse than my sister must have felt. Or Francine. She was pregnant. <laughs> Fucking bastard. It's not gonna be quick, Jake. <laughs> what the anchor do, bitch? It's big. You wanna cut me? Come on.
baby! It's just not fair. It's no damn justice. Even if there were, we couldn't bring Francine back. But at least she knows. We made things right. No, Brenda. You made things right. Take a stand. 